Hi, welcome to Bristol Street Motors Renault and come with me and take a sneak peek to the new Megane E. So, some new features on the Megane E. As you can see here, you've got the fantastic new Renault emblem, which personally I really do love. Looking further down a front facing camera to give you that overall 360 view of the vehicle. And finally, as a special addition on the launch vehicle, you can see here, you've got the gold trim on the front, which gives it a really nice sporty effect. On the launch edition, which is the top spec vehicle, as you can see, you get these fantastic 20 inch alloy diamond cut wheels. On all the vehicles and all the trim levels, you do get diamond cut wheels. They're all just different trims, but they make the vehicle look absolutely fantastic and a lot bigger as well. Moving up from the wheel, as you can see here, you've got your charging point. Nice and easy to access, will only open when you've got the key on you as well, and it gives you a detailed description to tell you what charge your vehicle's on. Moving up into the area of the vehicle, as you can see here, you've got your fantastic contrasting black wing mirrors along with the roof as well, giving it an excellent overall look. You do also have a camera in here as well to give you added protection when driving and reversing. With it being hands-free keyless, once you walk up to the vehicle, it does actually open as so, and that obviously the door handles just open as they're nice and flat to the vehicle. So looking up into the top of the vehicle, you've got this fantastic chrome finish as well. It's got a nice flat base handle, which is nice and easy to access as well. And it's got a brilliant entrance way, so you're not climbing over any wheel arches and it's got a lot of space and capacity for passengers as well. Looking to the rear of the vehicle, it's got some fantastic features as well. Starting at the top, you do have a camera under here, which is obviously your rear view camera for your rear view mirror. Moving further down, again, you've got a nice streamlined line also, which goes through from your brake lights and your reversing lights down on the rear. And also, as you look down further to the bottom as well, you've got another camera under here as well to make sure you've got a wide angle shot for reversing, but also your reversing sensors as well which are all around the vehicle. Looking into the rear, it's just one little button. You press, press it and it does have a nice lightweight boot. So that's all the exterior features done. Now let's jump inside and see what it's got to offer. So as you can see, getting into the vehicle is nice and easy. And this is all in my driving position as well. And I'm five foot 10, so it's got absolutely fantastic amount of space for knee room and also for your head height as well absolutely brilliant you've got two usb type c charging points down here again also your isofix points are nice and easy to be accessed down here on both sides and also you do have some nice skylights in the rear in the rear and the front of the vehicle as well and it is all electric windows all around but now to the most important seat in the vehicle the driver's position first impressions of this vehicle are absolutely fantastic the photos and the words do not do it justice. From the overall specification of the vehicle, coming with your cruise control, your speed limiter, electric parking brake, and all the Renault additions as well, i.e. Multisense, Google Play, even from a basic trim, trim level, you get fantastic features like heated seats and a heated steering wheel as well, which is especially important in those winter months. From this driver's position, one of the main features is your rear view mirror. So obviously at first it is a little bit strange, however it is a fantastic feature as you can utilise the entire clear picture as well and it means it won't get dirty also. Obviously looking into the further areas of the vehicle, this fantastic tablet like screen, again which can control all your features i.e. your heated seats and your heated steering wheel, but you do also get Apple CarPlay and Android Auto all incorporated into the vehicle where you've got the fantastic element of Google Assistance. From the screen, you can access all the different features. So as you can see here, you've got your sat nav, working your way along, you've got Google News, but also your music as well. So if you do have Spotify, Apple CarPlay, obviously all those different elements. Obviously, once you link your phone, you can see everything in there as well, and you can make plenty of phone calls. From the application screen, you can access all the different areas on the vehicle, whether it's the manual that you need a quick question for, or whether you need to check your calendar to see if you've got anything on. And finally, on the far side, you can select all the different fe vehicle features and go through them all, i.e. your 360 camera if you need to check anything, or if you need to look at the overall vehicle, 
and the servicing requirements or anything else on the vehicle you want to make sure is working correctly. From this point, once we've clicked on the electric vehicle side, you can see the different elements of where the electric's going. So as you can see at the moment, I've got the air conditioning on, so the vehicle is utilising the battery and it's going to the AC unit. As you flick through, you can see you've got these different areas. So when you're charging your vehicle, you can really utilise it. So if you're charging at home, you can charge in those peak times between 4am and 7am and really utilise the fact. So therefore you're paying the least amount on the tariff to charge your car and get maximum capacity for it. As you can see from here, again, with the new Renault emblem, really fantastic but from the overall steering wheel conception you can see you've got your gear shifter up here which has got your reverse neutral drive and park looking further into the steering wheel it's a nice sporty feeling with the flat bottom steering wheel and also a flat top so it's not as much of a circle but it is that sporty essence you do have obviously your auto lights and your auto window wipers as you'd expect and also you can utilize just from your fingertips your cruise control your speed limiter and also the adaptations for if you needed to speak wirelessly, anyone to call or answer, and you do have multi-sense as well. All I'm doing here is I'm going through my multi-sense, so you can go from various different elements on the vehicle. So if you want to know that you're driving a bit more economically, it'll go to green. If you want to be in sport, as shown, it's in red. That's one of my personal favorites. And if you want to be in a personal element, so you can tune it, really fine tune it to you, you can do that as well or if you just want a regular driver, you can have it in comfort. So with it being a virtual cockpit, you do get your sat nav behind it as well. So that's all from me. Thank you very much for listening and watching our fantastic video of our Megane E. If you want to find out more, please come down to the dealership.